Hello guys, it's me, Hunt Man. Welcome back to my channel. This time on the second review for the day and the last review for the day. I thought I'd just give y'all one more um, review. And that sounds so stupid, but I'm going to keep it in. I'm going to keep it rolling. So, this time we're going to look at Scott Hall from the NWO. Um, Scott Hall recently started in the WWE as our Razor Ramon. Then, um, he, quote, I'm using the quotes, left the WWE to go to um, the WCW. And they started a, 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 a click to call the NWO. The leader of the NWO, and I don't have that figure, was, well, he wasn't Hollywood Hogan at the time, but he was just Hogan. So, um, they start off this the black and white, the um, NWO. So, they supposed to have been, getting close again, supposed to have been breaking it up. But this was also around the time when um, the NWO, or excuse me, the WCW was a little on shaky grounds. So they were trying to spice it up a little bit by splitting the NWO from white, white um, black and white to red. So Scott Hall uh, went to the other side. And then they tried to, I even had it had where the NWO, NWO, um, uh, NWO Red will go against NWO Black, etc. And then it, it, and then it, 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 it just got crazy. Then we got the Lucia doors and oh, just mad, bloody mad. So Scott Hall is one of my favorite wrestlers. He has his ups and downs in life, in, in life, and just like anyone else, um, he's still around today. So he's, I finally saw this in in a Target. Um, yesterday, uh, uh, I put it up on Instagram, a picture, but the original retail price of the figure was 21 and change. Um, sometimes when Target get changed, do do, um, put a lot of stuff on clearance. But when I saw $10.99, I said, this guy Hall is coming home to me to be with my rest of my wrestling figures. So, I oh, further to do, and before we go, I'll go in for our further to do. If you notice, um, right here, you see the NWO sign and this legend sign. Now, when, um, and you also see it also up top, right there. Now, that was just by art, uh, art design for for that. So there's nothing wrong with of uh, nothing wrong with the packaging. That's how it should be. Um, now, back in the day when the NWO, they was, they was being the heels of wrestling. Some of them, like I said, some of them being good, some of them being bad. Um, and I used to love the heels. So, sometimes with them, by being the click, they would put the NWO sign over there because they posted, quote unquote, here, we're doing the quotes again. They're supposed to been trying to take over WCW, because the WCW is supposed to be that name ground, so that's the reason why you would see like the spray paint on the box with the NWO size logo on it. And then for um, artwork, they put it on the box, and I, th I actually really enjoy it. And as you can see, it does come in that nice brown and gold tight lettering for the legend figures that you can get. And other figures you can get in the line. You can get um, Bam Bam Bigelow. We also um, got Scott Hall. We got Big John Stud, and we got the Macho Man Randy Savage. I'm looking for that Macho Man. I wouldn't mind getting that Big John Stud. Um, the Bigelow, I probably might get a chance to find. Oh, well, actually, I think this is a good legend line. I really do. I all one, two, three, one, two, three, four. all four figures. I can't count. Um, Mattel put out. I think this is a really, really good line. And if you want to, here's the bio if you want to read it. Right there. I don't know how the heck you're going to read that sideways, but that's the bio. Guys, I'm trying to get it where you can really see that. Actually, sometimes I can read pretty good sideways. I don't know actually why. So, without further ado, we're going to open up this Scott Hall figure. And we're going to check it out and ski. And I can take over YouTube and it could be Sean... NWO. So, 
don't go nowhere. If you do, come back. Let's check it out and let's see what this Scott Hall figure is all about. Alright guys, we're back. We got everything out of the package. And our first hand I'm showing you is the, the two sweet hand. They would put this hand together. So, so showing solidarity of who they are. They are the click. So that's one hand that you would get. You do get a mic holding hand. Doesn't have the tape on it. You do get a mic holding hand. And you get the two AO hands with the thumbs right there. And you also get the cloth with the Valco on the back with the NWO logo on the front. And the NWO logo stands for New World Order. That's and then here's the Valco on the front. You can valve that on. And we'll I will show you at the end of the video how that look on him. And in the packaging, he does come with the um the WCW microphone. You can hold in his hand, and if you want to, you can put the other um, the microphone in the other hand. So let's move the microphone and everything. Um, this the, the bandana is is one separate. It's a separate piece. Does not go all the way around. If you want to, you can easily remove it. That's all you got to do. And it's gonna be, be removed. So we're gonna put all that in the accessory pile. So it it's. It's fair enough. I think it's I think it's fair enough. I could say we could say it looks like him. Uh, the chest hair is pretty much how he did look in uh, wrestling. The facial hair is pretty much how he looked in wrestling. Um, the hair is kind of neutral, but I think if you want to, you can say yes. That's Scott Hall. There we go. It's, it's a, if it says in the back, it says Wolf Pack on the back of his trunks. Doom 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 doom. That was the song they would use, the Wolfpack song. Um, the knee pads, there you go. They got the Wolfpack type colors with like like um the um um like they've been sprayed on. You do got the um the the black and red boots or the red uh, um strings in there, and you do have to have the two pair holes at the bottom, and um I think to be with y'all guys, if you do get this figure. Let's see if I have that. You can use a NECA stand if you want to. Let's see. Let's see if that, that pick hole will fit. Yeah. If you want to, you can put them on the NECA stand. It'll fit perfectly. So you won't have no scout hole um, down. But see, it's on that, the NECA stand perfectly. You can buy those NECA stands out of Target. I think they're like, like, like $9.99. Until they're always going to be with the um to keep the high end stuff at like the um the Necker um predators and all that type of stuff. So if you want to look for if you look for those stands, they also had the flight stands over there. So without further ado, let's get right into articulation, guys. Um, the head goes left to right. The hair soft enough, so if you want to, you can get that full ro rotation. Um, no, no really up and down, just a little bit. That's about far as you're gonna get. But it's it's gonna bounce back up. See how I'm pushing it down? It goes right back up. If you do send it up, it's not gonna it's not gonna go up high. It's gonna pretty much it just went back in a neutral position. Um, you can get the shoulders to go that far forward, that far up on both sides. No hindered. You can get a nice rotation all around. You get a nice um about ninety degree bend at the elbow. Nice rotation in the upper muscle right there. Um, air crunch is one by one click forward and going back to the new position. Uh, that by far, the, they're going to go back. You have a nice dive rotation. I bend the knee. The, um, the knee pass is going to hinder it. It's going to probably very much bring that knee back because as soon as you do it, it just want to pull it back. Now, normally I just cut these off anyway because I, I don't really don't like the knee pads. I wish it was more to me if I had my way. They'd be sculpted on there. Or at least maybe Velcro or something. You can take them off and on. Um, you do nice get a nice calf rotation. And you do get a, a little bit of movement in the ankles. Now, I always have a lot of problems with my ankles when coming down to my wrestling figures. Now, the best way to get around that, if you do buy wrestling figures, 
um, is to heat up the, uh, the ankles. Just heat them up. Just take some hot water or a blow dryer and just give it a little bit of a few seconds and that would take care of that. I didn't do it. I just went, I just went cold turkey on this, um, on this review. But yeah, I guarantee if you heat these ankles up before you move them, you won't have no issue with them. So they always, most of the time in the packaging, is stiff. But you're not going to get that big range of motion. Um, you get a nice little split. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I'm going to put a, just put a shirt on. And we're going to wrap up this review. So everyone, hope you have a good day and good night. Enjoy your collection, whatever it may be on. Um, be safe out there. And I will talk to y'all guys later in the next type of video, uh, how it may, where it may be, what it, it may be on. It might be a haul video, guys. It might be a review view. I might want to be sit back and just want to shoot the breeze with y'all guys. I do that sometimes, too. And um, once again, to all my new subscribers, thank you for subscribing to the page and everything. And leave your comments. Tell me how you feel about the review. I mean, I know y'all sometimes it's kind of say it's a nice review, it's a nice figure. Um, thank you for sharing. I get that, but I want to know what you really, what you really think about the review. That's all, because I, I mean, if some things that I need to um, try to work upon, I will try my best. Maybe I gotta get better lighting. I would most definitely would try my best to do what I have to do to keep, to keep the audience, y'all, my audience, and everything. So I'm gonna put them on the thing. Get them all nice and set up. Because you know why? I might be NWO for life, but y'all my YouTube family. And I want to just, hey, thank you for sharing. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for everything. Thank you for just, just popping up and watching my crazy videos. And I'm going to put all the accessories on the stand. And that's all, folks. Once again, enjoy your collection. Be safe out there. And I'll talk to y'all guys later. Next time, you the high man. And the high man is out.